ಶ್ರೀ ಗುರುಭ್ಯೋ ನಮಃ ಹರಿ ಹಿ ಓಂ ಜೈ ಶ್ರೀರಾಮ್ ವೆಲ್ಕಮ್ ಟು ಅವರ್ ನೆಕ್ಸ್ಟ್ ಎಪಿಸೋಡ್ ಇನ್ ಅವರ್ ಕಂಪ್ಲೀಟ್ ರೀಡಿಂಗ್ ಆಫ್ ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ ವಾಲ್ಮೀಕಿ ರಾಮಾಯಣ ಇನ್ ದ ಪ್ರೀವಿಯಸ್ ಎಪಿಸೋಡ್ ವಿ ಸಾ ಹೌ ವಿಭೀಷಣ ಕೇಮ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಡಿಡ್ ಎ ಶರಣಾಗತಿ ಟು ಶ್ರೀರಾಮಚಂದ್ರ ಸುಗ್ರೀವಾ ವಾಸ್ ಆಫ್ ದಿ ಒಪಿನಿಯನ್ ದಟ್ ವಿಭೀಷಣ ನೀಡ್ಸ್ ಟು ಬಿ ಕಿಲ್ಡ್ ಶ್ರೀರಾಮಚಂದ್ರ ಕ್ವಿಕ್ಲಿ arranges for a meeting of all the important vanara sena nayakas and he is asking for their opinion now we shall see as to how each of these vanaras are speaking to sri ramachandra ityevam paripristhaste swam swam matamadanindritah swopacharam tada ramam uchu priyachakirshavah these vanaras they quickly started talking to sri ramachandra because they all wanted to please sri ramachandra agnyatam nasite kinchit trishulokeshu raghava atmanam poojyan rama pruchyas yasman suhrutaya they said oh sri ramachandra you know everything you know what is right and what is wrong in all the three worlds but if you are still asking us for our opinion it is only to increase our respect in the world and now we are going to tell you what we think about it and then they started talking the first man to speak was angada and he says like this shatro sakasat sampraptah sarvadha tarke evahi vishwasa yogya sahasa nakartavyo vibhishanah this vibhishana he has come from the enemy to us so we should always doubt him so we should not resort to any quick decision and think that he is our friend and we should not trust him so quickly so these people who have very bad things for us in their hearts they can come and they can talk to us as if they like us but we should be very very careful and we should always ensure that we understand what is there in their heart and we should think about it we should check their character and only then make them our friends so this is what angada opined then there is another vanara called serabha and he is talking like this he is saying o sri ramachandra we should send a spy pranidhayahi charena yadhavat sukshma buddhina pariksha tatah karyo yadhanyayam parigraha so we should send a spy to him figure out whether he is a good person or a bad person and if the spy says he is a good person we should take him in if the spy says he is a bad person we should not take him then jambavanta he stood up and he said baddha vairascha papascha rakshasendra dvibhishana adesa kale sampraptah sarvadha sankyatamayam this vibhishana he has come to you in a place which is not a correct place in a time which is not the right time so o sri ramachandra i doubt if we can actually trust this man now tato maindastu samprekshya naya panaya ko vidah vakyam vachana sampanno bhavashe hetum uttaram after jambavanta said that you know we should doubt this guy because he has come in the wrong time another vanara called mainda he stood up and he said like this o king anujo nama tasya isha ravanasya vibhishana pruchyatam madhurenayam senair nara vareswara we should first talk to him in a very very sweet manner in a very very polite manner and then bhavamasya tu vijnaya tatastvam karishyati yadi dushto na dushto va buddhi purvam nararshabha so he is saying o rama o sri ramachandra then when we when we talk to him we need to understand what sort of person he is and based on what sort of person he is and based on our understanding then we can take a call as a samskara sampanno hanuman sachivottama uvacha vachanam slekshnam ardhavan madhuram laghu so here hanuman who knew all the shastras he waited for all the important people to speak and now he is putting forward his opinion he started speaking like this nabhavantam atisreshtham samardham vadatam varam atisaya itum sekto bruhaspati rapi bruvan you are as great as bruhaspati o sri ramachandra even bruhaspati is not greater than you when it comes to speaking let me just tell you what i am going to speak navadan napi sangharshan nadhikyan na chakamatah vakshyami vachanam rajan yadhardham rama gauravat i am going to talk whatever i am feeling as the right thing in this particular subject this is what swami hanuman is now saying to sri ramachandra and he is saying ardhanardha nimittam hi yuktam sachivaistava tatra tatra dosham prapasyami kiyana hyovadyate now some ministers have told that uh, have opined and they have told all their opinions to you o sri ramachandra but let me tell you what i think because i feel that there are a few mistakes in whatever they have told you rute niyogat samardhyam avabodhum na sikyate sahasa viniyogohi 
Doshavan Pratibhati me. So he is saying, Angada is saying that we have to understand his strength and all. But how do we put him into any activity right now and understand whether he is the correct person or not? And then some other people, they have told that we have to send uh, our spies. But Chara Pranihitam Yuktam Yaduktam Sachivaistava Ardhasya Sambhava Tatra Karanam Nopapadyate some are say, saying that we should send our Guptacharas and all. But how can we send Guptacharas at this particular point of time? Because there are only four people who have come here. And then another person told, Adesa Kala Samprapta Ityam Yadvibhishanaham Vivaksha Tatrame Stiyam Tam Nibodha Yadamati Now, some others said that he has come to us in a wrong place and a wrong time. But then... How can we understand whether what is the right time and what is the right kala when, when we are at a war? And hence, now see, Dauratnyam Ravane Drushtva Vikramanja Tadhatvayi Yuktamagamanam Hitra Sadrusam Tasya Buddhidaha. This guy has seen Ravana's badness and he has seen your goodness and he has come here. So, for him, he tried till the last moment to convince his king and since the king did not get convinced, he has come here. So what can be a good time What or what can be a bad time for a person of this sort? Hence, O Sri Ramachandra, how can we check that? Okay. And then, Ajnata Rupai Purushai Sarajan Purchatamiti Yedukta Matrame Preksha Kachidasti Samikshita Now some are saying that we have to send some spies in a different way and figure out, right? But then how can we do that? I have one way in which we can figure out and he is saying this way Pruchyamano visanketa sahasa buddhiman vacha tatramitram pradushyeta midhya prushtam sukhagatam If you go to an intelligent person and you start questioning him he will immediately doubt the person who is questioning him So at times when we really get a friend without putting a lot of effort that friend might actually go back Now there is one way O, o King Asektam sahasarajan bhavo bodhum parasyavai antarena swarair bhinnair naipunyam pasyatam prusam. If you want to really understand whether the person is speaking truth or not, whether you can uh, whether you can trust that person or not, you will have to go for the swara or the pitch with which the person is talking and you should be very intelligent to figure out what the person is talking from the pitch with which he is talking. Natvasya bravato jatu lakshmite dushtabhavata prasannam madanam japi tasman me nasti samsayaha. Now, I have looked at the his, I have looked at his face when he was addressing Vanaras and talking, and then I, I realized that his face was actually prasanna means he he did not have any agitated face. I did not sense that he was he was having a second thought in his mind. His face was plain. It was simple when he was talking. Hence, I believe that I I don't have any sort of bad thoughts or doubts on this one particular person and there is no dosha in whatever uh, whatever he is speaking desa kalo pannam cha karyam karya vidamvara safalam kurute kshipram prayogena abhisamhitam o rama o sri ramachandra i personally feel that this person realized that the desha and the kala are good and hence he has come and o sri ramachandra we should also understand that this desha and kala are good for us and now that we have got an opportunity in this form of Vibhishana, we should not let it go. Udyogam tava sampreksha midhya vrtam charavanam valinam chahatam sutva sugrivam chabishejitam rajyam paradhaya manastu buddhi pura mihagataha eta avattu puraskutya vidyate dasya sangraha. So, this man knows that you, have, you are putting in a lot of effort. So, he saw the effort that you are putting and then he has also seen the bad things in Ravana. So, has seen what what is bad with Ravanasura that also this man has seen and he also knows that Sugriva has become uh, has has been made the king now I think this man has come here that so that you would kill Ravanasura and then he would also get the kingdom the way Sugriva has got hence we should take him even if he has come here only for this last thing or this last reason and then he is concluding his speech by saying Yoktam tu Rakshas Yarjavam Prati Pramanam Tvamhi Seshasya Surtva Buddhimatam Vara O Buddhiman, O Sri Ramachandra, O person who is the greatest among the intellectuals I think this Rakshasa is good and this Rakshasa has a good thought process Hence, I have 
spoken to you all this and since the now that you have listened to all this you decide on what needs to be done now what does sri ramachandra think after all this that with his infinite grace with his nirhetika krupa kataksha vikshana of sri ramachandra we shall try to understand in our next episode sarve bhavantu sukhinah sarve santu niramaya sarve bhadrani pasyantu ma kaschit dukkha bhag bhavet om sarvam sadgri sai smara swam charanar vindar parmastu swasti jai shri ram